Hey there guys, welcome back to another epic food review. Today, I have KFC again, but this is with a bit of a twist this time, you see. And today, I'm going to teach you guys a hack about how to get your chips and your drink for free. I know that sounds ludicrous, but it's something you can really do, and I think you should try it. So... I, don't, I can't speak on other countries, such as America, uh... Fuck, where else they play NBA? I don't know. Anyway, I don't know about other con countries, but in Australia, the country of Australia, on your receipt, in fact, it'll talk about it on the back, but on your receipt, you'll get this big QR code. Don't scan that, please. Actually, I should... Don't scan the code that I've got on there, but you'll get a QR code on your receipt. And basically what you do is you scan this. And then you, you go to the KFC website and it makes you do a survey. And you do the survey and basically all you got to do is say highly satisfied every time. And eventually, it'll just get you to say, okay, what did you like about the food? You just say, the food was great. And then it'll ask you, do you want to answer any more questions? And then you say no, and then you're done. You take that code that comes up on your phone and the receipt to the counter. Usually, they don't take the receipt anyway, but it's always good to take it up just in case. And uh, yeah, and then they give you free free food. So it's pretty good. Um, now, this means that you can get a Zinger meal, for example, like, like the full combo meal for uh, about, oh, well, how much should I pay today? You can get it for five ninety five. Now that's, that's a fair price for what you're getting. This is a $6 meal here. Uh, however, I must say, considering that, I mean, if I'm broke... It's likely that I'm going to be eating something like this in, in a car, like what I am doing right now for this review. And if I'm eating this in the car, I must say the smell that is coming from these chips really isn't that great. I don't know if it's the specific location that I went to or not, but these, like, they don't smell like the worst thing ever, but it really stinks out your car and it's not like something that you want all the time. Anyway, I'm going to try some of these chips before I have the burger. Oh, uh, oh, oh, yeah. Oh, it tastes so, it tastes like freedom. What the fuck? Oh, uh, oh, uh, oh. Uh. Okay. I think I might set those for later. That's quite delicious, actually. You've also got the Solo. Solo, Solo. I think the cans are usually like $2.50 each from there anyway, but... Mm. Oh, why does this taste like freedom too? Oh my god, this is the most liberated I've felt in a long, long time. Ever since she left me. Um, so here's the burger. Mm -hmm. Have a crack at this, see what they're like today. Sometimes they give you a really big piece of chicken, sometimes they don't. Uh, I must say, the bread on the underside feels rather kind of stale. Sometimes the bread is kind of iffy at KFC. But here we go. Um, that is what the chicken patty looks like. It is a pretty... I mean, that's a good size. I did only pay $6 for this, to be fair. However, sometimes you get them bigger, sometimes you get them smaller. Anyway, let's give this a try. It's very mild tasting in comparison to other times that I've had KFC recently. Uh, that's what the inside of the chicken looks like. It's okay though. But. Well, 
the bread really makes it quite lacking in how good it could be. Whenever I go to McDonald's and I have their McSpicy burger, <clears throat> I'm so glad they put that really soft bread on the bun. I mean, the, the bun is really soft. The bread's really... Okay. The bread, the bun, aka whatever, is really soft on those burgers. And KFC don't do that. It's, it's very filling, which is great if you're broke like me. But not... If you don't want to, if you want to be able to eat the chips, you can't have the whole burger if you've got a small stomach like me. But overall, for value, I rate this probably an 8 out of 10. Only because you can get a cheaper $3 meal doing a similar. Uh, tactic that I'll show off in a future video at Hungry Jack's, the Australian version of Burger King. However, um, while that is half the price of this, Hungry Jack's is terrible in comparison. So that's that. Anyway, I'm going to wrap this up. Uh, yep. I, I do black tar heroin. I like to inject it into my um, arm.